On May 31st, the Canadian Plastics Industry Association held its annual awards luncheon designed to honour the latest round of award winners. Held at the Sheraton Toronto Airport Hotel, the luncheon drew a large crowd of industry leaders, researchers and other workers. The event was kicked off with a few introductory remarks by CPIA President and CEO Carol Hashu, followed by a keynote speech on ethical oil and the Canadian plastics industry by Ezra Levant, a Canadian author, journalist and TV anchor with Sun News Network. The CPIA awards were then handed out to a series of individuals and companies covering a range of categories. Dr. Mahini Sain, professor and director at the Centre for Biocomposites and Biomaterials, University of Toronto, won the Plastics Innovator Award for his breakthrough research on natural fibre reinforced thermoplastics. He's also one of the principal investigators for the Ontario Biocar Initiative, a partnership between the automotive industry and the private sector whose goal is to accelerate the use of biomass in automotive materials. Stuart Clark, the founder and president of Mississauga, Ontario based plastics recycler Simplas, won the Plastic Stewardship Award. To date, Simplas has diverted over 12 million pounds of post industrial pipe and another 3 million pounds of post consumer plastic pipe and siding back into local markets nationwide. Newform Building Technologies Inc. of Woodbridge, Ontario won the Recycled Products Award for its Conform and Reline brands of polymer construction products. Both lines are made with a minimum of 55% post-industrial recycled plastics. The Newcomer of the Year Award was given to Quebec's Group RCM Incorporated, a non-profit corporation that employs people with physical or cognitive limitations. Since 2010, the organization has operated a processing line that uses a high-speed, waste-free thermokinetic process that transforms all elements of plastic bags, straws and film into low-density polyethylene granules suitable for a wide array of applications. Last but definitely not least, the famed Leader of the Year Award was presented to Paul Cohen, the CEO of Brampton, Ontario-based polyethylene film extruder W. Ralston Canada, Inc. Cohen was being recognized not only for his leadership of Ralston, but also for years spent pitching in on a variety of plastics industry committees and councils. He's currently the chair of the CPIA's Board of Directors, a past chair of the Plastic Film Manufacturers Association of Canada, past member of the Management Committee of the CPIA's Environment and Plastics Industry Council, and also the recipient of a CPIA CanPlast Award for Outstanding Leadership. We asked CPIA head Carol Hashu to give us a sense of what the afternoon accomplished. I thought the event was fantastic. Uh, a great uh, opportunity to celebrate all that's good in the Canadian plastics industry. A wonderful uh, gathering of the clan to recognize and celebrate individuals and companies who are leading the charge and advancing the industry, whether it's in recycled products, innovation, stewardship, newcomer, leader of the year. So uh, uh, a wonderful chance to um, celebrate all that's good in this industry. For more about this year's CPIA award winners, including a feature on Leader of the Year Paul Cohen, pick up the June 2012 issue of Canadian Plastics Magazine.